Welcome back, heroes. <gasps> you guys, you just met Garjada Hammerlane, the wizard. She's chair of the town council here in Elirin. She warned you, you're going to be in her city investigating, trying to find the escaped elf druid. But she said, don't fuck up my town. And you guys, yeah, I mean, a little bit agreed. You took a shot of lavender gin with her, celebrating to love. Some of you did many, many, many of them while she had her back. This turn. many. And you can still count a four. Yeah. And you will roll at advantage for an hour, having left her chambers. Yes. It also, as you walk through the hallways, feel refreshed. It has restored your hit points. Oh. And spell slots. Oh, dope. Yes. Part of the way that she develops these tinctures, tonics, and cures. It's part of her amazing abilities. I that love her a little bit more now. She uh, hopes you are also a little bit in awe and fear of, as she told you that she will come after you if anything terrible happens in her town as a result of you being here. Some of you also went down, you inspected the cells, you found a clue mm -hmm. left to you, maybe by the Green Mother, a single white kymond rose collected by the paladin. We still gotta find a pot for this. It's actively dying mm -hmm. right now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you've been moving through the oh, council God. halls, guards are showing up, not like, you know, rudely telling you to leave, but gently nudging you in the direction of the doors, so that as you walk forward, you leave the council palace into the streets of Elyrin. As we're out, the last rays of the sun diminish, and you guys enter the night. Mm. Sanguina, <laughs> you can finally walk the streets free. It's dark. <sighs> You see stars twinkling in the velvety night sky. The two moons, Imba and Rowana, light the sky. You walk forward. You can hear people. They're clearly still on their way out to parties. But as you guys had walked the halls earlier, you'd heard some screams, some commotions. And when you walk out into the street, you notice that some people are moving in a direction farther away from you. People are in motion. I mean, are they... Are they running away from us? Are they blood-curdling screams? They are not blood-curdling screams, uh. no. Are they happy time screams? <laughs> They're not happy either. Uh. It's I hard to tell. Where are you running to? Roll perception. Everybody? If you are trying. Oh, yeah. Yeah, all right. Let's uh, see what's going on. Yeah, you guys are going in. Sure. <laughs> Watch. <laughs> Rolled twenty-two. What? Really? Both yeah, yeah, yeah. Both I botched. <laughs> twenty-two. <laughs> High five, botch team. Never mind, guys. <laughs> Seventeen. Team botch. Twenty-two. Nice. Roll your percentile dice. Easy. We're That's gonna right. work our uh, way around the table. What did you roll? Twenty-two. Fine. No, no one else botched. Just you two. Okay. So <laughs> just checking. <laughs> while you guys roll your percentile dice, we're gonna work our way around the table, starting with the paladin. Fifteen. Fifteen. You know that some of the. Screams you'd heard earlier. Maybe some in delight, but some of concern, warning people. Mm. 22, you can tell the direction that it came from. And as you look down, you can notice that there is an alleyway just out of sight. There are some feet on the ground sticking out from that alley. That's never good. 17. 17. Good number. In the distance, you spot the brief flash of something hard to determine, maybe not entirely opaque. A translucent flash. Eight. <laughs> <laughs> you are so enjoying that it's night. All you see is that the sky is spectacular in the darkness. Okay, for this. Uh, 91? Oh. 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 Four. Okay, so what you're, not paying attention on the street is instead you turn around and you're looking back towards the town council hall and you see some writing there. Oh, I do like writing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you do love to read things. Do you speak dwarvish? I sure do. <laughs> <laughs> Please tell me it says. Why do I even wall. ask? It's graffiti. 
It says, Vivalahir, Thaldor, Erunadar, and in dwarf you know that it means, our mountain meadow, those who endure our home. The motto of the town of Eliorin. Roll your D4. Four. I... <laughs> Like bye tips. Bye. Bye, <laughs> well, while you're, you also see the feet that are sticking out, and while you're watching them, stairs, your mortal enemy. <laughs> <laughs> you take a little bit of a tumble. You just catch yourself, but as your hand grabs the barrier, the stone takes a bit of a cut, slices all the way up your hand. <sighs> the blood gets Sanguina's attention. She turns around to you. Stop that. You you stop that. I don't want to... You stop that right Didn't there. you just eat, like, a little bit ago? Listen, this is fresh. Shh. Hello. <laughs> um... So, you gotta ah, it, right? I, I think we just need to pay attention to not the blood. Yeah. It's... But perhaps the can I um, can I beat. wrap this? Does anyone <clears throat> does <clears throat> anyone have a? It really hurts. Sorry, I can't. It really hurts. Stop that! <clears throat> Ow! Stop it! Stop it! Uh, I mean, does anyone have any? Do you want my paladin flap? <laughs> I can lick it clean. Just yeah, she can. Uh, it's I'll... fine. It's fine. You'll be fine. Uh, you said something about feet? Yeah, over there. Look, oh, just in that alleyway. Did you see that flash of translucent light? There's a druid, right, it's a druid. Not. Did you see the motto? Uh, what? what? It's a town motto, it's on the wall over here. Oh, for heaven's sake, Christ, we're trying to focus here. Yeah, it's a nice dwarven motto. Yeah, yeah. Oh, interesting. Oh. Why is it dwarven? Clearly everybody ran away from that. So I think we need to head over there. I have a prediction. see what's going on. I have right. a feeling that what's over there is what we've been warned about. The Paladin? Mother? No, no, children of the seed. They just drop like flies. Oh, I don't the think. Feet? What, but they, we're feet. in like the. Oh. Sorry. <clears throat> we're in the really wealthy part of town where children of the seed tend not to be. Mm. Oh, let's go. Oh, Why are we asking questions? Let's go, go and investigate. And investigate. Right. Okay. Feet or legs? I'm going for the feet. Yeah, I say we check the feet since they're right here. Okay, let's go to the feet. All right. Ears attached to, the feet. to bodies as well. <laughs> oh, crap. Just saying. Well, nope, don't mutilate any bodies in town. If the person's already dead, so it doesn't matter. Where I find Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> the gods themselves curse them. All right, so coming over to the feet, yeah, yeah. we're gonna start Don't touch them, inspecting. Well, that was really. Uh... <laughs> 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 oh. Oh. Stand up, everyone. Enjoy. Take this in. <laughs> All right. Real. Place your minis at the end. Yeah. Oh, it's a meal, because I'm, I'm not worried. Oh. 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 Do you need? Who needs it? Uh, I need. Uh, mm. oh. Who would you like to be? Oh. There's a wagon. Uh, I'll be close to a building or structure. Yeah, this me way. too. Yeah. I'm gonna unmiss it. Okay. Thanks. You can spot <laughs> from between these two houses the feet on the ground. <gasps> I'm gonna go over okay. to the feet. Yeah, I'll go with her. Okay, we'll move you forward. Got. The if they're going forward, I'm gonna actually hang Moves back. Move forward. So Ranger I'm gonna back. I'm gonna pretend to oh. act all. <laughs> I'm gonna pretend to act all kind of. Sh Shadowy, but really, I'm just hanging back and taking care of my hand. Okay. Oh. June's a little soft. Or is your hand taking <laughs> care of Self care. Self care. No. What's everybody else up to you? No. What? No. Don't tell me. Uh, I'm watching, keeping an eye out. I'll slink along. Yeah. I'll slink along behind. Uh, slinking along. Slinking bit. along, heading towards the body. Okay, there's some barrels over here, so maybe you're like slink, slink. Slink, 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 slink. Slink, slink. <laughs> you're hanging back with I'm the hitting. ranger? Yeah. And the monk. Uh, I am going to uh, hug the wall and approach cautiously. Part, On the other side way. here? Yeah, but not not as far as them, so. Great. Oh my god. 
This is amazing. Yeah, I am. Look at the it is Yeah, I'm into this. <laughs> spectacular. The town of Elyrin by night. And as you get closer, you spot those feet are connected to someone you recognize. Oh, <gasps> sup? No. Someone who put those seeds in your pocket. Uh, I. What did I say? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I was with her at that point, so I. You recognize her as well. Yeah. What do you guys see? Uh, it's one of the children of the seed, you were right. Um, it's the one who uh, Seno, Arn, and I saw when we went to the tavern. Well, then I don't know what everybody's freaking out about because they just seem to do this. They're dropping like flies because uh, they're sick. I'm gonna try and jostle her and see if she's dead or sleeping. <laughs> yep. Roll a medicine check. <laughs> medicine check. Whatever they have, she it could be contagious. 16. As you approach her, she is on her back, face to the stars. A look of horror, frozen on her definitely dead, pale face. Her eyes wide, the dried blood crusted along the outsides of them. Uh. Her mouth is stuck in the shape of an almost scream. Yeah, she's not sleeping. She dead. Um, what race is she? Can you see how she died? I'd like um, to investigate the I, body. The weird thing is it looks kind of like she died from fright because she's stuck in like a like a rictus scream. Oh my God. Rurik? Yeah? I wish this didn't take so bloody long, but uh, I think you should uh, detect magic. I uh, don't think... While I investigate the body. I don't think we have to... Roll investigation. I, I, if they, we just heard this scream happen? You heard other humans screaming. It's not clear. Some of it was warnings, shouting at people to run. Some of it was people out in the streets are partying and making lots Someone of noise. Someone discovered it. Which kind of direction was the flash from? The flash of light? Yeah. Down here. Over there? Um, yeah, I'm going to go look that way. Okay. I'll head over to the flash of light, too. Okay, we have two moving to the flesh. You are staying back to inspect the body. I would like to, uh... Moving the... Carefully. Are you moving stealthily? Uh, I move towards where I saw the flash of light come from, and I'm apprehensive. I'm checking out, looking for danger. Okay. Something killed something. You're moving forward. Someone. You don't hear anything yeah. now. It seems strangely quiet. The rogue right behind you. Start coming forward, up. keeping about the same distance. Uh. Hey, you're both on the move. The paladin inspecting, investigating the body. Wait just one second, Irvin and Ali. You and? roll for perception. You find on her here. more of the packets of seeds. Oh. And that's all that you can find on her person. She has no belongings to her name. I'd like to just run my hand over her face and close her eyes and just do a little like hair on you, that one. And then I'll come over and I'll join the others. As you start to move towards them, it won't help. You hear another, the beginning of a scream that starts. The wail echoes through the street. It pierces the mind. Uh-oh. By the way, natural 20. Can I get a witness? Oh, no. Oh! <laughs> nice. Thank you very much. Hey. Okay. Kirk Franklin? <laughs> Can I get a witness? <laughs> Can I get a witness? There's perception, yeah? Perception? That's right. You're looking down towards right. what is definitely a blocked, dead-end alley. Your brain begins to rack as you hear the scream of a banshee! Oh, oh no! The translucent light. It is her form, trailing ribbons as she floats towards you. Her arms stretched. She has horrible claws at the end. Face just horrible. Elven features distorted with hate. And her wail hits you both. Ah! Roll. A. Constitution saving throw. Uh, 
Nothing. You're fine. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> you drop to zero hit points instantly. Oh! 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 The rogue collapses. <gasps> Uh, Sanguina! I don't think we're talking our way out of this one. And everybody roll initiative. <laughs> but my charisma. <laughs> I don't have revive it. Oh, yet. come on. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, we're going to start with Elendar. I rolled a 10. And then did you add anything? Oh, yes. Sorry. Oh, I yeah, 10. Sorry. Okay, 10 total for the monk. 11. 11. For the paladin, Aaron. Seven. This is going really good. <laughs> Seven for Alany, Ranger. Rurik. Rurik. This is bad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so in a You shock. still roll. Uh, okay, oh, right, still right, after right. the initiative. Uh, doing it, I'm doing it. Right. Right. Oh, it's a. Uh, 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 what is that? Eight, eight. Sixteen. The rogue. And now, 20. Yo! Orla, now? Oh. All right. Still. Seno. <laughs> yeah. You watch. You can really only just make out the hints of that scream. But Rurik bolsters himself. The rogue drops. Oh. You act first. Jeezy uh. Pete. Uh. <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, so first things first, I believe I get a free, like, nature check or something to see if I know what this is. You sp spot at the back, almost to the end of this alley shape, a horrible twisted figure floating tendrils of her dress that's been torn, spectral. You can see through her. Ar arcana check then. You can choose which one you're going to use. Between nature or arcana? Mm -hmm. Definitely arcana. Uh, 24. It's a banshee. And what do I know about banshees? What do you know about banshees? You know that once per day, they can wail, and that it is quite dangerous and can be fatal. But you also know that they can move through people and objects and float through them. They fly. You know that it's they- It's standard ghost stuff. <laughs> you also know with that excellent role that they, if you see their face, that it can make this distorted, twisted, horrible visage. And that when you see that, it can cause damage. You also know that their touch is very dangerous. If they can get close enough to you. Okay, okay. So uh, I use my bonus action to uh, hex it. Um, has disadvantage on, let's say, constitution saving throws. Okay. Or ability checks. Gotcha. Uh, yeah, okay, and then I'm going to use my action to Eldritch Blast. Mm, probably don't hit. Uh, 16 and a 10. 16 hits. Ooh, one of them hits. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, so 10. From the warlock's hand. Oh my god, seven damage. The blast. The blast of purple uh, fire comes out of my hand, flies towards the uh, ethereal figure of the ghost. And the second blast comes out and just goes a bit wide. <laughs> <laughs> they blast into the. This is what happens with your tea, mate. Oh, yes, I get the extra. It's laundry <laughs> hanging along the line behind her. It flaps and blasts as the flame. Th 13 damage total. 13 damage total. Uh, and, uh, you know. Magically. I'm going to yell out uh, while this is going on. She probably can't scream again. Don't let her touch you. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Team player. Team player! Got me that. As you see like, the banshee. Sounds like you were trying to make a cheap collect call. <laughs> <laughs> it hangs up in Don't practice proof. At zero hit points, make your first death saving throw. <sighs> Is it just. It's just a straight. Roll 
your d20. D20. That's Let four. me know. Mm. You fail the first death saving throw. You can mark it off. Okay. The banshee moves forward. Mm. She comes towards you, Rurik. Ah, crap. Moving towards you. And banshee. The flash of her. She yeah. is fast. Ugh. She's hideous. <laughs> her hair flying behind her as she races towards you. <laughs> she reaches out with her gnarled, translucent claws to grab for you. <laughs> she makes an attack. It definitely misses. Yes. It's a nine against your armor class. Ah. Nice dodge. <laughs> she stands in front of you, floats in front of you, to be quickly joined, floating through the wall. Oh, God. Another banshee. Oh, shit. Oh. Damn, that one can still scream. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she moves forward and joins the initiative order. <laughs> That's the most horrifying thing of all. <laughs> Arn! Uh, I would like to, I'm going to reach for one of my javelins and I'm gonna say, Rurik, hit the dart! And I'm going to launch my javelin for... <laughs> Guys, I have some really bad Wait. news. Team. The Banshee Whale doesn't work on undead. Oh! Does that mean we get to restart combat? No, 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 no. no, no. I don't think we restart the combat. We're not going to restart. Are you That's sure? That's my bad. I don't know anything about Banshees. What is your bad? You've fallen. <laughs> but I can get up. But you can get up. Yeah! <laughs> Back to full hit points. Don't celebrate yet. Yes. She's at full hit points. Nice. We're gonna leave you prone. Okay. Your human side took this. Um. You're still half human. Mm-hmm. 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 Right. You're only kind of undead. <laughs> it's knocked you out for a turn. Narrative logic. Yeah. 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 Right. <laughs> Killing it. Killing it. Plot armor. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're kind of undead. Right. Okay, so. Right. It'll work on you the first so I, there you go. I'm just knocked out for a round, but I still have my full hit points. You are at full hit points. You're, you're prone, because it knocked you to the ground. That's right. The human side of you. Right. Okay, Damn. all right, you're making a spear attack. Oh no, you're not, no, not. making a spear attack. Yeah, she, she botched it by yeah, the time. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. For yeah. sure. <laughs> Did you roll your percentile? You that. Roll your percentile dice. You're making a spear attack, right? Throwing. Throwing it. Uh, okay. Uh, javelin. Javelin. Two. You gotta roll the second one. Yeah, roll the right, second one. Right, it's always the one. <laughs> <laughs> so that was four. Seven. Roll a d4. Hope you're permanent. That's gentle. Three. So, you go to make your javelin attack. Instead, when you see the other banshee appear, you panic, slightly. Oh fuck! Not in the way of like a bad panic, more in the way of like a warrior ready. And when you do that, you, you kind of, you move this, the javelin back into you a little bit and it stabs into your shoulder and you take three hit points of damage. Not your coolest moment. <laughs> <laughs> There's two of them. I thought don't you took Dennis Reagan. <laughs> What's with my crossbow? Ellen Dyer. Yes. Okay. <clears throat> uh, let's see. I just want to see how far away from that first banshee I am. Uh, can I reach it with a dash action? You are 65, 70 feet from it. 70 feet? Yeah, I can reach it with a dash. Yep. Uh, so I am going to use a Step of the w w Wind, and I'm going to dash as a 
bonus action. I am going to, uh, where Rurik is, mm -hmm. I am going to... Oh, no. Oh. I'm gonna roll on the ground. <laughs> no, no, I'm gonna get it. <laughs> Monks, I mean. It's a real sweet move, mate. <laughs> it looks like you're on the ground. Really, it's much more parkour. Than this. <laughs> of course. Okay. It always is. Uh, yeah, so I'm basically going to. Um, uh, if I can get in on the other side, away from that. How many? Here. You have what, 15 feet left? Yeah. So you wanna flank here? Yeah, and uh, and I am going to attack her with my silvered spear. Good <laughs> 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 thinking, Gibbs. Mm, thank you. I mean, <clears throat> yeah. You got this. <laughs> you got this, Pubindar. You got it. Don't call me that. That's not my name. I don't even like tips. Don't call me that. <laughs> um, you say, make your attack. Say not yes. to call tips. Sorry. Right. Uh, <laughs> sorry. Check, checking my. Oh, oh good. Uh, 14, 21. Whoa. That hits. Excellent. The silver spear connects with the translucent banshee, but it does stab into her. She screams out. Not magically. That's correct. Mmm. Five points of damage, unfortunately. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. She takes those. You can tell that you've wounded her. Not gravely. Mm-hmm. I will. In time. Which one do you attack? The same one that I did? Yeah. Nice. Alany. All right. I uh, look down the field, and I can see everybody right there. Uh, all right, I'm gonna cast Hunter's Mark on the currently damaged Banshee. And then I lift my bow and notch my first arrow. And I definitely hit that, that's 20, but my second arrow does not. <laughs> uh, you lose two quick arrows Yeah. towards the Banshee. Shouldn't have tried to Legolas that. <laughs> <laughs> Just one at a time. <laughs> <laughs> Flies over the top of the shoulder right. of the dwarf, connecting with the flying banshee as Whoa. the streams of her dress and the tendrils of it whip out behind her. And then I do seven. 19. Hit for 19. Okay. After Alany, Rurik. Uh, kind of cowering and freaked out by this really creepy thing behind my shield, and I go, Ah, Tor Varala, help me out here! And I channel divinity and cast destroy undead or turn undead. Uh, if they are at uh, 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 half CR or lower, they are destroyed. <laughs> Which I'm guessing they're not. Okay. So they are turned away from me for <laughs> a minute. Until they take damage. So on their turn. I'm gonna spend its turn trying to move away as far as it can. Uh, creatures within 30 feet of you are affected for a full minute. Mm -hmm. And once it takes damage, the effects wear off. Mm -hmm. So both of them are gonna die. You know what else? What is does fun? this look like? What is it that you do here? In the face, the terrifying face of the Banshee. Uh, literally said Torvarella, help me out here. <laughs> <laughs> Say it again! Torvarella, help me out here! And uh, a, a wave of red light pulsates up from the ground and around me in a radius, and it would hit them and pulse, push them away. <laughs> so what is it actually causing? Yeah, they're basically afraid of you. They're immune to being frightened. Yeah, they don't take damage. But if they're undead, they have to go away. They have to make Anxious. a wisdom, wisdom saving throw, sorry. There we go. Uh, there Creature fails at saving throw, is turned for one minute. Yeah, definitely. The first one definitely fails. All right. The second one fails, too. Yeah! Good, good, good. good. Those are some <laughs> shitty rolls. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I'm scared here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Amazing. Rurik, is that the last? Um... Of your turn? So they both fail, they're gonna be turning and running away from me? They will be. Oh, thank you. 
Um, I'll turn it to you each of you. Run towards me if you can. I'm gonna sidestep. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm good. I'm gonna sidestep the one that I'm at, and just so the towards the wall or into the street. Uh, into the street. Okay. Toward Elendar. Uh, but I'm staying close to it. Okay. I'm just getting along beside it, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna swing up with my hammer as a. Uh, oh wait, no, I can't because that was an action. That that was an action. Cancel that. I say brimstone. I need you, and I cast spiritual weapon, and I summon a floating flaming axe. Double bladed. Fancy town. To attack the one that I'm right beside. Where does it appear? Right where I just was. Brimstone appears and attacks. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that 20. Yo! <laughs> You're fucked up now, son. Uh... <laughs> Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> the lowest damage I can do. Uh, so that is five damage, so ten. Ten so, damage. All right. <laughs> so that one's no longer turned, but the one that can still scream is. Okay. Here we go. Back up to the top of the initial order. Seno. Okay, I'm going to target the one that I have hexed again. Mm -hmm. uh, Just do a little rotate. Here we go. Which one is it that I have hexed? That one? You have hexed this one. Okay. Um, well, I'm going to forward, not too close. I want to take some, like, half cover behind these barrels. Just, you know, just in case. Okay. Uh, yeah, and Eldritch Blast. So, describe what you do here as you run towards the barrels. Down I go in these barrels, I get down behind them, and I cast my Eldritch Blast. You know, pop flames coming out of each hand. Uh, the, uh, second one, uh, first one goes wide for sure. Um, You're taking a 12? real no, sorry, eleven beating out on this clothing line behind her. And the second one, Those linens are ruined. Second one, right on the money with uh, twenty-four. <laughs> yeah, uh, hit. Yeah, and then I do my. <laughs> <laughs> It's the razzle dazzle. <laughs> this damage is not great, but it's nine. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, and then I have. Do I have any bonus actions I can do? Yeah, nothing. So that's it. Good turn. Set up. Crouch behind some. Sagrina, to come up from being prone, it will take half of your movement. To stand right. up. Well, I get up, and I. So the human part of you. Racked by the banshee scream, you collapsed. But then, bam! Ha! Angry. Uh, you I cut are my ass back also off. undead, bitch. That's right, motherfucker. Uh, so I want to dash. I'm dashing towards that banshee where Rorik is. Oh, you don't need to dash. You can make. Well, oh, skip. <laughs> skip. <laughs> I'm fine, I'm fancy free, why can't I skip? You That's can true. skip. That's true. I'm skipping over. <laughs> <laughs> skip to the boo. Get it, yeah, it's a ghost. Yeah, yeah, I heard it. <laughs> I heard it. You are that one you get. almost face to face <laughs> with this floating, the darkness, I guess. terrible monster. I thought that was a real scream. Throw acid in her face. You can try. I'm gonna throw acid in her face. No, 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 no. Throw acid in her face. This is not. No, I like it. I tried to throw acid in her face. I'm so close. I should be able to throw acid in her face. So you can't. You throw. Right. Right. So we're gonna do to throw something. Right. Your D20. Yes. Plus your strength. Oh. That's how many feet it goes. You can easily. Absolutely. Throw it to order. My, my strength is zero. So. <laughs> you can still hit her because you run right up to her. Right. Exactly. But you throw it at her. I throw it at her. It smashes. She's immune to poison. Nothing acid. happens. It's acid. No, it's yeah, 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 it's acid. She ain't got nothing to melt. It's a ghost. Well, look, she is resistant, so she only takes half damage. How much damage does it do? She takes six. Nice. So 
so three. Three. <laughs> <laughs> three. Three. Evil. Hitting. <laughs> Smashes. That was a dust. way better choice than your sneak attack. You know? Right. Great damage. Great yeah, damage. It's just sometimes you just want to <laughs> do you're things. You're calling out from behind the barrel. You like, just want to do things with, good the, job. with a bit of flair. <laughs> I just want you to bit of flair. That's all that I want you to You pop up. Angry. Teeth bang, you race <laughs> towards her. You're both staring at each other. You're both undead, angry, women. Splish. <sighs> you were <laughs> It face. was a crime of passion. I wasn't thinking, I wasn't in my right mind. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. yeah, yeah. Might... She turns towards you. And she makes a distorted, horrible face. Her face goes from kind of scary elf, creepy lady, to a terrible monster and she just <sighs> back at you the acid's still streaming down looks good on your bitch mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so sassy roll of wisdom Damn. saving throw <laughs> 14 probably wouldn't have worked on you anyway but she doesn't know that right so you are fine and you're immune to any of the other Attempts to terrify you. <sighs> if it would have even worked anyways, because you might be the scariest undead thing in this whole alley. <sighs> She's with us. <laughs> <laughs> Mostly. Yeah. Mostly. Yeah. Sometimes. Yeah. The Banshee at the back. <coughs> I believe in miracles. Turns and runs away a little more. Mm. Gotta keep 30 feet from me. She does have to move away from you. She disappears inside the house. No. <laughs> You're so excited. Oh, you were so excited. No. <laughs> remain a target. <laughs> uh, you can actually like put her in the house, and I was about to just say. Well done, Rick. All right. Yeah. You better go away. She might come back. Since I have two attacks. <laughs> <laughs> since I have two attacks, did I was I able to, or because I botched, I don't get the second. That's how that works usually. Okay. Uh, once more, this time with feeling. <laughs> Take my javelin out of my shoulder, and I'm gonna say, "Hey, bitch!" And I'm gonna <laughs> fling it. My hit her. <laughs> See, it doesn't so. Did you? See, seven. Oh, oh, well, plus what? What plus stuff? I don't. You, oh, sorry. Plus seven is a fourteen. This is great. Oh, there we go. Yeah. That's a hit. Yeah. 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 Yes, I hit something! <laughs> so for 1d6, yes, and then yes, one, quite. Yes, we put <laughs> And then 1d8 as well because she's dead. Oh! The paladin is so effective against the undead. It's the last thing it sees before it dies! Yes! Ah. Uh, Always coming in and stealing the kills this one. You know that, I like. I really had this one. Glory <laughs> <laughs> I whip my hair, Stop and I'm like, I finish that cry, I'm like, eat javelin, wench. And I do the like Brad Pitt in Troy, like the leap and the just like, <laughs> and it just like, hits her just like so friggin' dense. Just like, a black hole, like, <laughs> and then It doesn't do as much damage, because it's not a magical weapon. But it does enough, <laughs> and she drops. Does it go through her? Because I'm right behind her. <laughs> Bye! It catches in all of her kind of... Ether. Ectoplasm. Ectoplasmic acids. The whatever it is that makes her Ecker. able to interact, touch, Ecker. wail, Benchish. affect the world around her, and as she vaporizes, all of the bits of it falling down, the spear collapses to Ugh. The javelin collapses I'm gonna to the ground. Walk over like super slow mo. You can't back. move yet because your eyes are all still in oh, combat. Shit. <laughs> I need my javelin. You can move because you haven't moved yet. I I'm gonna walk towards the doorway of that house where the second bitch went, but I'm gonna cross and pick up my javelin. Just for okay, so you go to pick up your javelin. That's uh, that's what you'll be able to do. You head towards there. You stop where your javelin was, which puts you in the banshee. Inside of the batch. In it. All right, it's I'm gonna need to back up for her to come back out. So, when it gets to me, yeah, yeah. Run away. Yeah, I got it just a bit. 
You actually can't make it all that way. That's okay, I'm on my way. Okay. Everyone knows what I'm about to do. You are on the way. And acting after you. Elendar. Okay. Hmm. Excellent. So I am going to uh, post up between uh, Rerick and uh, Sang. Guina there. Over here, over here. Uh, uh, on the other side there, yeah. And then, uh, with my spear kind of in hand, I'm going to ready uh, an action, and I'm going to prepare to throw my spear at the first sight of the Banshee. Keep track. At the first sight of the Banshee. Alanine. <clears throat> uh... Can I, so I'm gonna prepare an arrow, but can I also be preparing to move Hunter's Mark the moment I see the Banshee? Or is that, or can I only do one of, or the other? You can, you could also just hold your turn. I can, okay. So you'd be able to hold on to whatever else you need to do. So you're gonna act after someone else acts. Okay, so can I, I'm gonna, I'm pretty good where I am. <laughs> I'm a distance fighter. I'm just going to stay right back here. Yeah? Uh, You're a bowman. I'm a bowman. <laughs> yeah, you know. um, but I'm going to uh, hold my turn until I see the Banshee come back onto the scene. So if you see the Banshee before we come back, mm -hmm. you'll be able to act. Okay. okay. Rurik. Mm. Uh, okay, I'm going to need to get back away. So I'm gonna, I've only got 25 feet, so I'm gonna make it back this way as far as I can and hug this side. You can move 25? Yeah. Okay. That way. And that way. That so way. you can make it about so here. Over that way, so. Okay. That's great. And I will advance uh, Brimstone, which is my spiritual weapon, mm -hmm. uh, toward where the Banshee disappeared. How far can it go? Uh, it can go. That's a good question. I think it's 30 feet. These and questions boop, 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 boop. and some more questions. And then more questions. 20 feet. 20 feet. It makes it over here. Okay. And, Running in the uh, middle of the alley. <clears throat> and yeah, that cost my bonus action. And I will ready guiding bolt for when the Banshee appears. Or if the Banshee appears. Or if a Banshee appears. Uh. I'm gonna stay in my barrel hiding spot. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, you know, I definitely got my boots of displacement going, so mm -hmm. there's like two of me hiding behind the barrels. Um, and, yeah, I'm going to ready if I see uh, any banshees appear. I'm going to bonus action switch my hex to. Uh, whatever Banshee appears, and then Eldritch blasts it. So, I hold my turn until the Banshee appears. Sanguina! I'll run over to where that uh, little wooden stand is right there, and I'll just wait. <laughs> you can ready other you actions, ready but... Other yeah. actions if, if all you're well, doing do I have is... to ready a snake attack? Yes, <laughs> you have to say what you're readying, and you have to say exactly what's gonna happen for you to be able to do that ready to action. Otherwise you're going to wait till the whole next turn. Yeah. Well, that's what I'm doing. That was what I planned on doing, was readying a sneak attack. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> so what kind no. of an attack? <laughs> well, I'm going to, uh, I'll prepare my short bow. And I'll, I'll shoot if you see her, you're going to shoot her with your short bow. That's right. Uh, Beautiful. And then at the back, you do see Banshee appear. Rick, it's out of the way. <laughs> the, the alley. <laughs> See, oh, a oh. banshee up here. From where? She's From outside banshee. of the house. She, just she comes through okay. this cart and appears. Is that the same one that disappeared? Mm -hmm. I don't care. It's at its grass. Uh. It looks from here like what you remember. Wow, well, very fair. <laughs> <laughs> it's another creepy floaty thing. I'm let loose my... Go, we're gonna go around the table with the actions that are holding. Okay. So. I let loose my spear as a thrown weapon. I'm trying to remember the range on it, but uh, 
17. Hit. And um, good number. <laughs> thank you. Uh, and the silver-tipped spear flies through the air towards the banshee as she appears and does nine points of damage. Nine points of damage. Were you holding an action? You were holding an action. I was. All right. I, the moment the banshee appears, I quickly look over at it and I move Hunter's mark right onto it. And then I lift my bow and I notch my first arrow. That didn't help. Sit down. Uh, <laughs> that's a 17. Hit. And then I notch my second arrow. And that's a 27. Hit. All right. And then Two I arrows do... are loosed towards the banshee. Everyone loves it. Uh, do I do... Does Hunter's Mark add damage for each consecutive arrow, or just the one? Mm. The extra damage? Uh, I think it's your... Oh no, that I'm thinking of... I think once you have the mark on, it's each attack? Uh, yeah, we can look this up. Okay, quick, quickly check that. Uh, but, uh, so, so far, what are we at for damage? 22. And is there and anything about these arrows that is magical? Four. 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 Plus ones. I have my plus one arrows. That's it. They're, so. If they've been treated with a magical, something about them that makes them magic, they are magical and count as magical damage. Okay. In my rules. Just says okay. whenever you hit with a weapon attack. So, so far we're at 26. Hit. Unless, uh, it says whenever you hit with a weapon attack? There you go. Unless they so uh, get yeah. an extra hit. One more. Better check it. It says, it says whenever. Oh, does it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, and then an extra five. Nice. Hit. What was the total there? 20... Or 31? That's a ranger right there. Very nice. Yeah, don't screw with my bowman. <laughs> <laughs> She's still up, though. See, he has a dumb name, too. Okay, who else was having... Oh, I had a guiding bolt ready. Guiding bolt. Uh, uh, uh. Then Sanguina was gonna do an arrow. And Seno. Oh yeah, I've got a line of sight. So I go, focus fire! Yeah, that is a 21. 21. Uh, That's a hit. She takes how much damage? She takes. Uh, 16. She takes 16 points of damage. Uh, and she is now glowing, more so. Uh, <laughs> she's now glowing red, and oh, that's radiant damage as well. Um, bu- 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 and she, whoever makes the next attack has advantage. That would be me. <laughs> <laughs> and that means you can use a sneak attack now, if you have advantage. Ah, These are all happening instantly, as you were all ready. So, we'll let it go you. Advantage. Roll. Roll your bow attack. 12. Hit. Eight. Plus sneak attack. Is it my sneak attack as well? Yes, because you you have advantage. Yay! Nice. For a non-corporeal being, she's kind of easy to hit. Mm. Taking those licks. <laughs> she looks rough. She's been hit by spear. <laughs> How do you tell her when she looks rough? <laughs> There's bits of her flying off. She lights up red briefly, as then another arrow comes flying at her. <sighs> Just pieces of her incorporeal dress and body fly away behind her and then she's hit by uh yeah i switch my hex off to her and and uh, shoot out my purple fireballs <laughs> and that's 13 for no both no one laughs <laughs> it's not blue uh, <laughs> they both hit. i didn't get that until right then. They both hit, and you don't even have to roll damage. Ooh. 
Yeah. <laughs> what does this banshee see before she dies? It's like person kind of up above the scene and just like purple coming right, right in its face and just like <laughs> vaporizes. And it's gone. Like steam in a fire. She does not get to act. <clears throat> but appearing behind you all. Oh, oh crap! It. Keep your distance! Sweet! Oh no! Oh shit, that's right close to me! Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> There's another banshee! Oh, shit! Oh, it's never going to end! God okay. damn it! On our six! Wait, wait. What's on a sundial? <laughs> Just a sundial. I don't want to be at this end anymore! <laughs> no. Look at your life, look at your choices. <laughs> <laughs> she floats forward with all her 40 feet of movement to appear. We're gonna take a break! Oh. Wow. I thought for sure I was fucked there. Oh. You still <laughs> are! Maybe Maybe it's, not not <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna happen, bruh. You're gonna oh, die. No. <laughs> Don't I got die. You, I got you. Yeah.